about Lee Griffiths and his ankle injury to begin with. What's the latest on that front, please? Yeah, he's a little bit sore, to be honest. He's, uh, he hasn't done too much training since last weekend, so uh, we'll give him up till tomorrow, see how he is. If Obviously, if it's any type of risk, we won't, uh, we won't play him, but we're hopeful that he might have a little chance. I mean, obviously, how important is Lee to this new look Hibs side? He's important, but I mean, it's like everything. If you know to improve as a team, you've got to have people that can come in and, and replace him. If he's not there, not available. So, um, you know, if he doesn't, if he doesn't make, well, then it gives someone else an opportunity to come and play in the team. How pleased have you been with the development of Paul Kearney? Because it is a big step up coming into the Scottish Premier League, but he's really seized this chance, and he's you can see it week in, week out. It's getting better. Yeah, I think you know we spoke to Paul at the start. We obviously wanted to improve his fitness levels, and he's done that. He's worked really, really hard pre-season and you know training sessions. He's 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 at a fantastic level now. So, um, but his game is improving week in week out as well. You can see him growing in confidence. I think the goal at Celtic Park, obviously a couple of weeks ago, has helped his confidence as well. So, no, he's he's going to be a big player for us over the course of the season. But he started the season really well. Just talking about the level of competition for places, we touched on it in our last interview. It's just incredible now, isn't it? The amount of quality. I mean, you had to. You left Shevki Kuchi out, 65 caps for Finland, and he didn't even make the bench last weekend. Is this one of the strongest squads you've ever worked with? Yeah, well, it's just, it's a strong squad. I think there was probably a twofold with Shefty is that we, you know, the fact that he might have played for a few minutes, and so we, we sort of worked him on Saturday morning, and then gave him a day off on Sunday. Worked him on Monday, and he trained. He played on Tuesday for the reserves, and. You know we've worked them, so it's just a, it's trying to balance it to make sure we get him enough training that his fitness levels improve. We're also getting him a bit of game time as well to help his sharpness. So, um, but we have that now. That's what we have. There might be weeks where people you know don't make the bench, and that's the competition we need to have in the place. And uh, the players that are playing at the moment need to know that that if their level of performance drops to a point where there's somebody of of real quality that can come in and play. You mentioned the reserves. Obviously, they played at Dunfermline earlier on in the week. Danny Handin played out wide right. You played him there in pre-season against Zealand Select as well. Do you see that as a, a possible role for him to occupy within the first team squad? Yeah, we've looked at him. We don't have a lot of wide players in, in the club, to be honest. That you know, and um, you know, we've probably really got Ivan, and maybe we've been playing D there and Paul out wide as well. So. Um, Danny's a, he's an intelligent footballer when he plays up front he, he tends to drop into little areas where he's difficult to play against and he uses the ball quite well you know so and the other thing he has he's got a, a, a knack for and an eye for goal to be in particularly when he's playing on, on the wide areas being at the back post and crosses come in so it's something we looked at we thought he's, do, he's done quite well there like you say away in, in uh, Zealand you know and again the other night I thought he's probably one of our better players so no it is and again he's a young player all the things that he can add to his game will help him long term, you know. So we know he can go and play in there, which is a plus for him because then it means we know we can play up front and we can we can play him off a front man or we can play him wide. So it will help him as well.